The Saiyans are a true warrior race. Don't underestimate God damn, bitch. Can you relax? Ow! That hurt. I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I'll have to use every ounce of my energy. That move! At victory. If I die. Oh my f oh. Yo. How we look? <laughs> Rate the fit, bruh. Alright, I gotta hurry up and beat this game because this shit is already itching, bruh. Listen. I don't know what I go through to entertain y'all. We have Dragon Ball. What is this called? Zero Spark. Spark Zero. Sparking Zero. Fuck. This came out. Actually, it comes out Friday, but if you buy the early edition, you get to play the game a few days early. So that's what we're going to do today. Ow. Oh, man. We ain't never going to be able to top that Master Roshi costume that we did on, um, on Kakarot. And I accept that. I ain't going to lie, though. I got the bad bitch wig, you know what I'm saying, for $14. Anyway, um, I need y'all to clip y'all favorite parts of the video or give me the hashtag funny moments with a timestamp in the comment section. Also, we started Silent Hill today as well. Um, this game better be good. I've only played, what, three Dragon Ball games? We did, um, I don't even remember the first two games, bro. I don't know what they call. We're all over the fucking place today. But I'm feeling good. I'm looking good. Uh, if you want a chance to win a copy of Dragon Ball Sparking Zero or another game, just make sure you comment below. Tell me who your favorite Dragon Ball character is. Follow me on TikTok. And let's get into it. Dragon Ball Sparking Zero Episode 1. Let's go. Boy, this is this dollar menu ass loading screen. <laughs> Us right in. Like a real yes. That's what I'm talking about. Yo, the animation looked kind of good when it came up. All right, how do I? You won't win just by flailing around. Wait a minute. How do you fly? Bro, what? Okay, hold on. Where's the fly button? RB. Yo. Okay. Hurry up and get serious. I put on on uh classic controls. I might put that hoe back on standard. Come at me with everything you've got. Take this. Come on. The guard. So we hold that. Okay, I'm just trying to get used to this, bro. Come on, I've seen you fight harder than this. Time's up. I need to go. I'm about to see some bad gameplay. Not done already, are you? Whis wanted to visit with Bulma again. If I want him to keep training me, I have to catch him before he runs off again. Man, no fair. I want to train some more, though. 
I'm about, it's, it's about to be bad. Now, there wasn't a difficulty setting, which is a plus for me. I ain't got to put this on hard. Wait. Yes! Yes! All right, now it's time for me to get my ass whooped. He finished the tutorial, congrats. Even more dynamic 3D action awaits you in Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. My RB is not responsive, that's the issue. Access super training from the battle training tab on the main menu to learn about various battle roles, views, demonstrations, and practice moves. Yo! I did not mean to do that. Hi. Oh, wow, okay. See ya! Episode and custom. Let's take a peek, shall we, Lord Beerus? Okay, wait a second. Wait just a second. So episode battle, is this is this how we do the story? Okay, let's do this thing. Bro, I hope I'm doing the right shit. I, I gotta pull this up. You should join us, Kakarot. Think of the battles you'll have. Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement from the thought? Shut up! If you think I'd ever join you, then you're dumber than you look! Huh? Oh, wait, 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 goddammit! Raditz! Child behind you. Is that your son? He, he's not! Yes, that boy indeed has Saiyan blood. It's no use trying to hide it from me. I can see his tail from here. So what if he does? You know, perhaps you need a little time to decide. I'll just borrow your son for a while so you can think over my... Bro, I don't even know. Yo, ain't no way. Knock you out! Back off! You're a joke! He blocked every goddamn move! Alright, hold on. How you do those? Oh, I see. We're settling this right here and now. Yeah. Oh, man, it's going. I'm, I'm about to learn all this shit. Yeah. I'll kill you quick. Move, 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 move. Am I in the way? Ah! Ah! That shit tickled. That's it, cool. You're a joke. All right, I gotta try to charge up my key more often. Trembling fear. We're settling this right here and now. Yeah. I thought I did Kamehameha. No, I didn't. Yeah. It's probably some right stick shit I ain't do. Oh. I did it? I just push your shit. Yes! If you want your little brat return safely, Kakarot, prove your Saiyan spirit. Eliminate 100 Earthlings and pile them here before I return in one day. And let me be very clear about this. If I come back and I don't see 100 corpses, I kill the kid. Shit. 
Goku is no match for Raditz's overwhelming strength and Raditz successfully kidnaps Go on. However, he is then treated to an unexpected reunion. Piccolo? But what are you doing here? I was pursuing him. And as much as I'd like to kill the wretch myself, the sad truth is I have a better shot at that if you were along for the ride. Hold on, you mean team up with me? Why in the world would you ever do that? Don't get the wrong idea. This would just be a temporary alliance, only for the sake of eradicating that alien off my planet. Once that purpose has been served, I'll keep my promise to crush you. And then I can get back to my plans of world domination. actually can make decisions. Boma, I need to borrow the dragon radar for a bit. Oh, uh, of course. Let's go. Think you can keep up with my flying Nimbus? You gotta be kidding. I'm a cut above the rest of you puny humans when it comes to flying. Raditz locked up the kidnapped Gohan inside a space pod. Goku aims to land a surprise attack, but Raditz detects him using his scouter. Y'all gonna make me read! Now Goku must face Raditz head on. Oh, Kakarot. I thought you'd at least be smarter than this. But you have no idea how out of your league you are. Let's skip the pleasantries. We're here to take you down. Simple as that. I'm sorry, brother. I was thinking about my offer, and I've changed my mind. You'd probably just slow the rest of us down. And for betraying the Saiyan race, you will die! I need to practice, man. Since you're going to be eradicated anyway, let me share a little something with you. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. <laughs> you could train yourself for a lifetime and never even come close to that Emmy. level. But since you were too stupid to heed my warning, you're not going to survive another day anyhow. Yeah. How about this? You miss, bitch. You're a joke. Yo, dog. Yo, the one line on this shit is probably nuts. If you've got a new special attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku. Ain't no way he did that to me. Nope. <laughs> Lazy fool. Meanwhile, I've been training non-stop to develop a sure kill technique. It's real? Bro, right, anytime I get close to him, he do that shit. The problem is it takes some time to charge up before I can use it. So I'm gonna need you to f So wait, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So hold up, so... Short dash, dragon dash. Okay. And then, man. First strike. Brush in A. All right. What about the defense is what I'm looking for. Triangle. All right. Here we go. Guard was B. Guard low, guard break. Counter. Fight him alone until then, if you can handle it. Gotcha. I'll take care of him. 
Every time I do a comment, yo, this dude, dog, is he? Ain't no way. Let me show you my full strength. Finally, Jesus. Let me show you my full strength. Bro, I got washed. Was I not supposed to win that shit? Can you win that shit? Guys! Say goodbye, Kakarot! What the? Power level 1307? Don't hurt my dad! Leave him alone! Dude, can they tell a non can non canon story one for one of these games they put out? Have a whole new adventure? No, stop! Don't do it! Please! He's just a just a child, is that what you were going to say, Kakarot? Don't worry, brother. You'll see your son again in the next world! What? You little P Piccolo! Your attack! Do it now! Uh, are you insane? Maybe, but it's the only way to beat you! Sorry to keep you waiting. Are you ready? Do it! No! Stop! Special Beam Cannon! On this planet, we have these things called the Dragon Balls. Gather all seven, and together they have the power to grant any wish, even if it's bringing someone dead back to life. You can all go to hell. Still, I thank you for the information. <laughs> Everything that has happened here today has been transmitted to my two Saiyan comrades deep in outer space. When they've learned that I've been killed, they'll come to avenge me. The, the other two Saiyans? When? When will they arrive here? How long? One year. Just one short year. <laughs> Damn. T two of them? Even stronger than him? How sweet does that victory taste now? They're going to wipe you all out. They'll soon have you writhing in agony like the worms you are. <laughs> yeah! What that little movie did at the end? What was this shit? After Goku perishes in battle with Raditz, Kami arranges for him to train on King Kai's planet. And just as Raditz said, within a year, the two Saiyans come to Earth. Finally having completed his training on King Kai's planet, Goku is revived by the Dragon Balls and returns once more to the battlefield. <laughs> Unable to escape, Yamcha dies in the explosion induced by the self-destructing weapons the Saiyans had made. One by one, the other warriors also fall at the hands of the terrifyingly powerful Saiyan. I ain't gonna lie, he needs some bigger shorts, bruh. Just when all hope seems to be lost, Goku arrives on the scene. <laughs> How's it feel seeing your little friend's corpses scattered all over? There was another one, but there's probably not a scrap of him left. Piccolo's gone. What, you gonna throw a fit, small fry? Go right ahead. 
<laughs> that stupid look on your face just makes me want to kill you faster. You'll pay for this! You'll both pay! You bastards! I felt that shit. When he said that, I felt that. All right, Nafa. Yeah. What does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What? 9,000? Man, god damn, bro. Be a mistake. Doesn't matter. A little punk like you can't do anything against the mighty Nappa! Ah, I missed. Over here. Solar flare. You missed. Nice. Oh yeah, he's way stronger this time. Gain that much power in such a short amount of time. Bitch. Oh, right. You're the greatest Goku. Show that muscle head who's boss. Get him, Dad. Come on. Too bad you missed, bitch. Vegeta, help me! Out there with them booty shorts on. Every time I see this bitch on the game, he got his ass out, bruh. What? Vegeta! Vegeta! No! <laughs> no use for a paralyzed Saiyan. You're dead white. Vegeta. He's a psycho. He, he, he just killed his own partner for no reason. Both of you need to get back to Kame House where it's safe. But, Dad, I... No, he's right. You saw what that other Saiyan can do. If we stick around, we'll only be getting in your dad's way. Sorry, Gohan. This guy's stronger than I thought he'd be. We've lost enough. I can't lose you two either. Okay, I understand, Dad. Vegeta becomes enraged as he watches Nappa being beaten to a pulp by Goku. Unable to control his wrath, he murders his comrade. Sensing the immense danger looming, Goku tells Gohan and Krillin to return to Kame House immediately. Then as Krillin requested, he moves the battle to another location. Let's finish this someplace else. Fine by me. Makes no difference. Goku selects a location devoid of human or animal life to challenge Vegeta to a one-on-one -on -one battle. Okay, this spot should do. From what I can tell, there's no people or animals nearby. Interesting. Of all the places on your planet, you chose this as your grave site. <laughs> you should feel lucky. Not every low-class warrior gets the chance to spar with a super elite like myself. Not long after Saiyans are born, their skills as a soldier are tested. The scum whose scores are ranked the lowest are sent to the outer worlds, where the opponents are weak, much like you were, Kakarot. In other words, you were cast out like a dog. Yes, and as a result, I was lucky enough to come here to Earth. I'm grateful for that. Besides, even a lower class outcast can surpass an elite if he puts his mind to it. 
<laughs> it's a nice attempt at a joke. Now let me show you a wall that you will never have the ability to scale through effort alone! Let's get it. The Saiyans are a true warrior race! Don't underestimate God damn, bitch! Can you relax? Ow! That hurts! Bro is yo, I I can't even get a hit on this guy. I got so much key. The Saiyans are a true warrior race. Don't underestimate them. Yeah, I'm about to lose the fuck out this fight. How is key so high? Yo, why is it so good? Guys! How long is the combo last, bro? All right, bro. This is it. I've had enough embarrassment for one battle. Your influence just cost you this world. What the? Maybe be a little closer for that. But you can stop my gallic gun. You and this whole planet are as good as space dust! Yeah, man, the Gallic Gun. I. I. He still got two bars. Dudes. Look at look at his head, bruh. Oh, was that supposed to happen? supposed to be Goku falls to Vegeta's attack with all the remaining warriors of earth also defeated the planet comes under Vegeta's ty tyrannical control oh shit I was not supposed to lose that he put his feet the other all on me okay I mean let me got you let me try to. The Saiyans are a true warrior race. Don't underestimate us. What is that shit? Yeah. 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 Nice. Charge up. Solar flare. I did not want to do the solar flare there. I've had enough embarrassment for one battle. Your insolence just cost you this world. Please don't miss. There's no way in hell that you can stop my gallic gun. That's exactly what just happened. As good as space does. Gun! Goddamn Gala Gun. The Saiyans are a true warrior race. Don't Awesome! Fool! Man, golly. Gun! Bam! This counter and shit, I'm getting fucked up. Be gone. And he called me trash. I didn't want to do Kaioken. Get out of Kaioken. How, how do I get out? Not the worst thing in the world to be in, but I didn't want to be in that.
bro. Oh my god. God damn it, bro. Yo, see, I need to learn how to do that right there. The knockback shit. Come on. This is it. I've had enough embarrassment. Charge up. Your insolence just cost you this world. What the? There's no way in hell that you can stop my gallant gun. You and this whole planet are as good as space dust. Well, I could have did. I could have did a damn spare bomb. Gallant. Damn it. I'm almost got it. Come on. Got you. Yeah. Oh, he got me. Oh, I got him. Nice. He blocked that shit. Too bad for you, buddy. All right. Finally. Jesus. It's been a hard fought battle, but summoning his last ounce of strength, Goku manages to counter Vegeta's attack. Though Vegeta was hit, Goku can still sense a trace of his key remaining. Yajirub emerges from his hiding place. I don't know how to say his name. Shut your mouth! But Goku instructs him to flee. Sure enough, Vegeta rises once more, ready to challenge Goku again. Goku believes his only chance for victory is to use a spirit bomb. However, Vegeta has a secret technique known only to Saiyans up his sleeves. Burst open and mix! Huh? What was that? What are you planning? You really should have never gotten rid of your tail, Kakarot. But now you'll learn firsthand what a Saiyan is really capable of. Did you feel that? There's a tremendous energy and it's swelling up even bigger. I don't think it's my dad's energy we're sensing, is it? Something's wrong. I'm going back there. Gohan, hold up! I'm going too! Wait! <laughs> Don't blink, Kakarot! These will be your final moments before I crush you! A am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey! This is crazy! How do I fight this thing? <laughs> Since when were we dealing with a hundred-foot-tall monster? With no other options left, Goku decides to use the technique King Kai taught him. Only choice now is to gather energy from all over the Earth and make a spirit bomb. Let's do it. No. God damn! After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa, and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was 
Boy, I can't see a goddamn thing, bro. I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see Damn it. you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. Bro, come on, let me charge up. Quit being a hater all your life. Yo, I'm get yo, I just got my ass waxed. Oh my god. Oh Bro, he laughing over my dead body. We try that shit. Yep, I'll break you. No. After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was was me. I owe this to you. Man, this motherfucker is strong as shit, dudes. No matter what, I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. If I die. I'll see you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. All right, let's go. Body, don't fail me now. You can't go there. I'll break you. Ain't no way. I'll vaporize you. I'm not missing. This is crazy. Yeah. Boy, you with it. Just for that, I'm going to crush you like a brick. I'll break you. Man. Oh, my God, bro. You kill me? He's a he's a tank. We shall not lower the difficulty. I'll break you. We shall stick here until asses get whooped. After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All all of that was was me. I owe this to you, Grandpa. I need to beat this guy. No matter what, I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see you in the next world. Yo, that move is bullshit. Apologize to you. I'll break you. Body, don't fail me now. I'll break you. They keep going. All right, bro. I'll break you. Move out the way. Just for that, I'm going to crush you like a great. Yo, how the fuck? Get out of here, man. I'll break you. As soon as the dance, look at this pussy, bro. After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa. And the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was... Was me? I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy. For the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see you in the next world. At 
least I'll get to apologize to you. Look at this shit, man. Get ready, Hame Hame. I'll bring you. destroyed the tournament arena all all of that was was me oh come on with this shit you. No. after all this time i get it the monster that killed grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena all all of that was was me I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy. That move! At victory. If I die... Oh my fucking god! At least I'll get to apologize to you. I'll bring you! is ridiculous, bro. Ain't no way. Anybody else get stuck here? Is it just, it's probably just me. And even if it even if it wasn't just me, you, you probably you probably pretended it, it, you you uh you did it yourself too. I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All all of that was. Was me? I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. No matter. That move, cow! Oh my God, bro! The grabs. I'll bring you. No. After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was, was me. I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. Bro, this dude just blocked every attack. Every attack I ever had in my life, he blocked all the missions. For the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. Damn it, that's me. That, 
I'm gonna be honest, bro. That, uh. Nice. Solar flare was done at the perfect time. Give me this one. Yeah. Don't 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 please, please, please. Finally, god damn it. Total focus to use the spirit bomb. It'll only take about 10 seconds. Come on, give me just 10 lousy seconds to concentrate. Dude, I I was stuck on this dude for like 30 goddamn minutes, bro. That grab attack. about the time he needs goku uses a solar flare on the great eight before him i should have used the solar flare a lot more because it stunned him especially if you time it right goku then makes a run for getting as far as away as he can there okay i think i put enough distance between us he gathers a little key from all living creatures on earth to fire one final shot in the hope of turning things around damn braces bro Oh, you coward! Where are you? Come out and face me! Time's up! He found me! There, it's done! I've gathered energy from every corner of the world! Now! Take this! This is the end of the line, Kakarot. Even if you do manage to come back to life, this miserable planet won't be around anymore. Why is the list moving like that? <laughs> Consider that a little farewell present. I don't have the strength to lift a finger. So just do what you're gonna do to me, all right? Take your best shot. <laughs> Damn you, Kakarot! How dare you leave a scar on my beautiful face! Just for that, I'm going to crush you like a grape! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Why don't I kick it up a notch? <laughs> What's that I hear? Every bone in your body breaking? Must hurt. <laughs> I think your friends are here. How quaint. Yarob, Yajirob? How you say that? Somebody tell me, please! 
who's been waiting for the right moment to attack leaps out it fuck you man vegeta returns to his regular form however goku remains incapacitated neither krillin nor gohan stand a chance against even a weakened vegeta calling krillin to his side goku entrusts him with the spirit bomb all that's left is to wait for an opening to use it this is it this must be the spirit bomb it's all up to you now What the heck are you doing just standing there? You gonna throw the dang thing or what? Huh? <gasps> no choice now. Take this! Ha! <gasps> Bouncing back, Gohan! I promise! It won't hurt you! Put me in the booth. Vegeta survives the spirit bomb. Caught by the light of Vegeta's small, false moon, Gohan transforms into a great ape and proceeds to corner him. Killing is just about to finish Vegeta off once and for all when Goku stops him, telling him to let him go. Having narrowly escaped death, Vegeta departs Earth. Now, aware of the existence of planet Namek, Krillin, Gohan, and Bulma believe it may hold a new set of Dragon Ball. As Goku needs more time to recuperate, the three set off for the planet Namek without him. Clear the arc. That is it for chapter one. Once again, comment below. Tell me who your favorite Dragon Ball character is. Break the fit, break the wig for the bad bitches. <laughs> like the video, subscribe, follow me on TikTok. Holla at y'all on chapter two. Make sure y'all check out Silent Hill if you want to see how that gameplay is. Till next time. Bye.